hi guys good morning so welcome back to my channel so for today's video ang topic natin ay tungkol sa youtube monetization program so ano ba yung youtube monetization program so bali kasi yung mga ibang youtubers uh, kaya sila nag youtube para syempre mamonetize at somehow kumita Um, naalala ko lang yung first time kung uh, nag-upload ng video dito sa YouTube. So, basically, ang goal ko lang noon ay uh, magkaroon ba ng parang diary na kung saan nandun yung mga videos na masyashare ko yung unang-una yung mamonitor ba yung progress ng aming uh, unika iha sa ngayon. Um, so, basically, yun yung reason kaya ako nag ano, ng YouTube. Then, later on, na na laman ko na pwede palang mag-monetize kay YouTube. So, ano ba yung requirement ni YouTube para maka-monetize? Kasi, syempre, kung madali lang yun, eh, di lahat na mag-YouTube. Kasi, uh, uh, other source of income yun, or syempre, cash inflow. So, ang requirement ni YouTube para maka-monetize ay kailangan meron kang 4,000 watch hours within 12 months at pangalawa kailangan meron kang 1,000 subscribers so nung nagsisimula ako kay YouTube parang sabi ko ang hirap nun paano ko makahanap ng 1,000 subscribers edi eh much more pa yung watch hours unless meron ka talagang video na nag trending ba diba? so nalukot naman ako anyway naisip ko ano nga ba yung uh, reason kung bakit ako nag-start mag-YouTube? Sabi nga nila, may kasabihan na if things are falling out of place or kung nasa isang stage ka ng buhay mo at nahihirapan ka sa ginagawa mo, remember the reason why you started it. So, I went back to my purpose at narealize ko, tama nga naman, hindi naman ako nag-YouTube para kumita agad-agad, agad-agad. Uh, Siyempre, bonus na lang yon So, guys, eto yung ginawa ko. So, ayun nga guys. Anong ginawa ko para hindi ako masyado malungkot bilang isa ako sa mga YouTuber na malayo pa ang journey bago ma-achieve yung 1,000 subscribers at 4,000 watch hours. Ayun uh, nga. Papakita ko sa inyo. Sabi ko nga, binalikan ko yung uh, reason kung bata ako nag-start ng YouTube so nagkalkal ako ng mga lumang videos ng aking daughter at eto yung na-discover ko watch this video ay not nice ang ginagawa anak ano bang gusto mo not nice naman anak oh ikaw ang ikaw dito ako alis alis ako dyan ka dyan ka ayoko naman ayoko naman ayoko naman ayoko naman Ayun pala yung lang pala. So, that was 2017. Kung mapapansin nyo, um, bali, 2014 siya pinanganak. 15, 16, 17. So, magti 3 years old na siya noon. Pero, she could barely utter a word. So, wala siyang word. Kapag may gusto siyang sabihin, irritable siya kasi hindi niya ma-express yung sarili niya. She resorts to crying. Eto naman, yung next video, panoorin nyo. Yeah. Yung si nanay, oh, nanay, hi! Hi ka ka, nanay, hi! <laughs> nanay, sabi mo, nanay! Ay! May sipong ka pa. Oh, God! Gulo na buhok mo. Ayaw na? Ayaw na? 
Stop na ba? Stop na. Say stop. Ma. Sabi mo stop. Sabi mo stop. Sabi mo stop. Yes. Stop. Yes. Sabi mo tatay. Stop. Stop na. Stop. So sa video na yun, mapapansin nyo, um, kahit yung word na nanay at tatay, medyo hirap pa siyang sabihin. Uh, nasasabi niya, pero isang syllable lang, ay. Tapos, yung stop, kasi isang syllable din lang siya. Please go D plus pag D pataan Pag mo nagit Ano yan? Ang video ba yun? Baby shark Baby shark Mommy shark Mommy shark Daddy shark Daddy shark ano sa lahat? Grandma Shark So, nung 3 years old siya Year 2017 Ang masasabi ko na naging isang accomplishment Ng Therapist niya Or yung milestone Dun sa pag-undergo niya ng Occupational therapy Yun yung pag-manage siguro ng tantrums niya Kasi kahit pa paano Kung hindi niya man ma-express yung sarili niya mas uh, hindi na siya mabilis mag uh, tantrums at mairita. So, noong year 2018, ang naging focus namin ay yung makapag-express siya ng kahit 2 to 3 phrases ng mga words. So, paano namin ginawa yun? Less TV, tapos halimbawa may gusto siyang hingin, uh, hindi namin yun ibibigay unless sinabi niya yung word kung uh, paano yun i-re-request. You're the Jelly Beast dog. You're Jelly Beast dog. Jelly Beast. Follow me. Follow me, okay? Follow me. Now at five years old, mas marami na siyang words. Um, ang goal na lang is kung paano i organize yung mga words para magin isang phrase na merong sense yung phrase na yon. At ito yung year na madaldal na siya. Medyo interpret mo nga lang yung sinasabi niya kasi it sounds Korean or Japanese. Hachi! House! Daya house! I can play and the wheel with the E yet. I can play and the wheel with the E yet. Me! Pull my hair. Pull it down. Pull it down. Pull it down. Pull it down. Ponytail. Hi. Hi. What's your name? I love you, girls. Grand down. Uh, how are you today? By the song. How are you today? I'm fine, thank you. How old are you? By the song. Uh, what? When is your birthday? August 28. Uh, where do you live? That's my Avita. Who is your tatay? Gary. Who is your nanay? Jigsaw. Oh. Anaya. What do you like to eat? I eat cake. Wow. Ice cream. And? Soup. Oh. Are you pretty? Yes. Why? Because he's pretty. Beauty, <laughs> And do you like to play? Yes. What do you like to play? I play Where is Wheel. 
plants, toys, spell sweet. Thank you. Ah, action. Sing and sing and sing Angry, dapat. Sing and sing and dapat. Naya. Hi. Do you have a brain? Yes, I can make my mind. Uh, oh, idea. Are you using it right now? Yes, I do. So, can you read this? Um. <gasps> bad. It's better. Bad. Okay. How about this one? <laughs> My brain is not. It's not working. It reads. C cup. Yes. Oh, yes. How about? I would try again. Try again. Okay. Okay, how about this one? Cat? No! You did it! How about this one? Uh, the! The is correct! Uh, how about this one? Uh, I'm right to see it. Comb! Oh, says. Comb! Okay! Okay, no, no! To my mind, so here I break it. Good time. Hey, Anaya. Today, baby. Pepper! Make it to the high color yellow. Oh. Yellow is yellow, and yellow is yellow. What does SpongeBob say? How about this one? Who's this? Or Patrick. Oh. Today. Can you talk like Patrick? Oh, you talk like Patrick. Her. Uh, her. Hmm? Uh. Hey, bye, bye. Hey, Patrick. Do you buy? She does my camera, man. Do you make my shirt too blue? Yes, yes. I know what you're thinking. Ngayon, sobrang daldal na niya. Sobrang dami niya ng words. Sobrang dami niya ng phrase. At marunong na rin siyang mga twiran sa mga simple paraan. Huwag niyo lang siyang tatanungin ng why kasi medyo dun siya hirap. Naya, we're stuck here. There's no jeep. We're going to sleep here. What are we gonna do? Jeep! 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 Naya, yes. what will you do in SM? Naya? You, what will you do? My toys. You will play? My toys. Are you going to play in SM? Yes. In I have a lot of But you don't have socks. I can't go. So, to sum it up, hindi naging ganun kadali or ganun kabilis bago na-develop yung kanyang verbal skills. It takes time, it takes patience, at syempre, yung love para dun sa daughter namin. So, sa mga mother or parents na katulad ko, na may pinagdadaana na katulad ng samin, always remember na mahal natin yung ating mga anak, kaya gaano man kahirap, kakayanin natin, at kung ano yung pwede at kailangan gawin, Try lang natin kasi wala namang mawawala kung susubukan natin. Basta at the end of the day, remember na hindi natin yung ginagawa para sa sarili natin, kundi para sa future nila. ba? O.
Ngayon, marami pa kaming journey na gagawin at pagdadaanan bago fully maging uh, verbally fluent yung aming anak. So, patuloy ko siyang isi-share dito para makita nyo na kaya, kakayanin. So, so, ay! Tada! Selfie! Selfie na yan, may video nga lang. Thank you for watching my video. Sa mga hindi pa nagsasubscribe, subscribe na kayo. Pwede rin kayo mag-leave ng comment or kung may mga katanungan kayo na kaya namin sagutin. Comment lang kayo sa baba. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye!